Hey everybody, what's up? My name is Nick, otherwise known here on YouTube as Valence, and today we have a pretty cool little package here. So I actually dropped by uh, and picked this up today. I know they're not supposed to be released until March 11th, but I got mine early, I suppose. I don't know if they're going to go on sale soon or what, but I did get mine early, so thank you to the person who helped me out with that. Appreciate it. Uh, whoever mystical being is caring for me out there. Let's go ahead and unbox this piece. This is the limited edition Xbox One controller. This is actually the first one that's been done. Apparently there's some uh, mechanical enhancements to the buttons and stuff that they've worked out some of the kinks for the Titanfall controller, so I'm actually really happy to get hands-on with this one. This is something I will have in my collection although I'll probably use this one a lot if the buttons are that much better. So it'll probably get a little wear and tear instead of just sitting up on my shelves. But nonetheless, I'm excited, so let's go ahead and unbox this beast. I haven't checked this thing out yet, but it looks looks pretty nifty. Um, I'm not quite sure how this box is supposed to work. Uh, let's see here. Oh, okay. I'm assuming maybe the tab. I really don't want to ruin the box here. Oh, there's a tab under here, so maybe it's this one right here. Let's see. A little bit of a little bit of box damage, which is quite discouraging. But hey, all right. So there we go. Looks pretty nice, actually. There you go. That right there, ladies and gentlemen, is the Titanfall controller. Looks pretty good, I think. That's the front right there. There's the back. Feels good too, actually. It feels pretty good. Let me go ahead and fix my focus here. There you go. So that's a little more in focus. Feels pretty good. Feels the same though. The bumpers are a little, a little more, and the thumbsticks seem like a little more locked in. Uh, they don't seem as loose as the original Xbox One controller I got with my Day One edition. But you have the decals there. Again, let me change my focus so you guys can see this. So you have that. Last Mosa Armory with a number on the side. You also have this right there. Restricted. Serial number, that's pretty cool. So restricted. And then over here, C101. Which is actually the name of the carbine in the game. Very nice though. Looks pretty slick. I love the details on it. I love how it's white as well. Very cool. Very cool. Feels pretty good too. Feels pretty good. So there you guys go. That is the uh, Titanfall controller. Pretty neat, right? I I like it. What do you guys think of it? Be sure to let me know in the comments. Again, this is the first time of me examining this. Of course, you're going to have your batteries too. I personally bought rechargeable packs, so I'll just be swapping out for a rechargeable pack. Um, and then it looks like that's empty. And in the back here, let's see. Let's see if this has anything in it. A quick setup guide in case you don't know how to do your little remote and then of course a accessory product manual for safety but there you go guys that is just knocked my camera a little bit but that's the controller voila not bad right So guys, that is the Xbox One Titanfall controller. I like the white color, I like the design, especially all the decals. It really feels like a lot of detail was put in this controller. Like I said, the only physical difference that I feel is the thumbsticks feel a little tighter, but other than that, not too much. So be sure to let me know in the comments below this video if you guys like the Titanfall controller, if you're lucky enough to snag one of your own, or 
if you think it was worth the price tag, that's kind of the big one. This was a $60 controller. I believe it was 60 So, you know, do you think it's worth the price tag? Anyway, guys, if you have any questions about it or whatever, drop in the comments below. That is my unboxing for the Titanfall controller. And stay here for more Titanfall content throughout the closed beta and into the game coming out in March. So thanks for watching, guys. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to share it with your friends. Also, like this video and subscribe for more gaming and nerd-related content every day here on the Avalance YouTube channel. Have a good one, guys, and prepare for Titanfall.